letter from the Lord given through Susan Davis on Monday, July 3rd, 2023. The topic, My hand is extended, but not forever. This is God. This world is truly falling apart. The enemy is working his plan to take down human beings, to destroy them and send them to hell. He wants to drive out all that is good off the earth. He wants to squash anything that has to do with me. He wants to bring about a holocaust of the word of God. He wants to destroy my name and to venerate himself. He's after the great to the small. He wants to plunder everyone's hope through me and replace it with a false hope. He's after the hearts of men and to destroy their souls. He's cunning and cruel. He would have you believe he's good and his ways are right. His good deeds are actions of terror. He wants you to believe that he has all the right answers, but the road he's on leads to eternal hell. He's blazing the trail and there's no way out. Once you succumb through death, your destiny will be sealed and there will be no means of escape. He blasphemes me at every turn along with all those who follow him. He poses as an angel of light, but beneath his facade are outcomes of terror. Those who reject me are under his spell and they have sold their souls to him. He operates right within the churches. He has headquarters deep inside the churches. His goal is to use my name for destruction and so many are falling for his charade. Many believe themselves right with me, but in reality have given themselves over to religious spirits. They worship their religions yet know me not. They engage in rot worship yet have not known me. They are being led by my enemy and they believe the light they are following is mine, but it is not. It is the deceit of my enemy. He's dragging many under. Only those who truly know me will be saved. How can that be? You must surrender everything to me. You must live your life down at my feet and understand I am the only one who can save you. It is only by my blood-bought salvation that you can be saved. You must repent to be saved. You must forgive everyone. You must profess my name. You must reject your own will and surrender to the will of the Father. You must desire to be filled with my spirit. You must spend time in my word and you must spend time with me all through the day. Come to know me as your closest friend and ally. Seek me for all your concerns, great and small. And no matter what, trust in me. Turn your back to evil and let me help you. Evil choices lead to death. Walk apart from this evil world. Time is short. These messages are real. Ask me to show you how short time is and I will do it. Waste not another moment in the hands of your enemy who desires for your destruction. My hand is extended, but not forever. Do not be as a foolish virgin standing before a locked door. These are words of warning and they are words of love. I am the God who loves. Amen. Read Matthew chapter 7 verses 21 to 23 and also 2 Corinthians chapter 11 verse 14. Hey. 
Don't get left behind. 